It's 2021. Climate change is about to destroy the planet. And the world's biggest military industrial complex wants to start a war. What does this moment call for? A national gender strategy. That's what this moment calls for. This is an actual White House announcement. OK, my question, how can a country be this dangerous and this lovable at the same time? I mean, the world is about to end and Americans are locked in this life or death battle to decide how many genders there are. It's kind of cute in a way. People's right to be multiple genders or whatever is important. But saving the world and not having a war is also important. America spends more on guns and bombs than the next 10 countries put together. But leaders want to steer yet more money to weapons makers. The easiest way to justify this is to get their friends in the media to write wildly unbalanced stories about China, especially Xinjiang and Hong Kong and Tibet and Taiwan. But one reader, thank you very much, Lynn, sent me a positive note. CIA staff responsible for coordinating pro-American activist groups in East Asia created what they thought was a catchy Asian sounding name, the Milk Tea Alliance. What the agents didn't realize was that 70% of Asians are lactose intolerant. The project got almost no support. War lost, peace won. Stay skeptical, think for yourself. Goodbye. <laughs>